So basically what's happening in this clip, which I can't be bothered to actually do anything with on the account of, um, I'm very lazy and, um, yeah, um, we couldn't really, I couldn't really put it into the Sony Vegas file because, um, I forgot to put it in and I couldn't be bothered shuffling all the files around because there's so many things that are split up. So, um, yeah, sorry about that, but basically, in short, we got a group spawn on Skyblock and, yeah, you can see him, um, whatever his face is, is um, link in the description to the channel, you can see his perspective, which is actually not sped up to acquire time to say things over it. So yeah, it's severely sped up, um, I'm, I'm just playing the bits while we get the creep spawner in, but I'm also bringing back the intro, for, like one video, please tell me what you think of the intro on top of all the other stuff, I tell you to comment in one video, but um, yeah, so... I like need sleep. We do improve it. We know the glass doesn't let let light in. Uh, no, the glass lets light in spawn that like stops spawning. So we didn't know that. Notice that and a few other things like the low ceiling. But yeah. So besides that, that's everything. And I really hope you enjoyed this. Took forever to edit, and it's gonna take forever to render. So with all of that, on with the video. Hey guys, what is going on? So we're back to a video that. Cinematic thing shot there just, just fails for me every time, doesn't it? But I'm back on Sky Metro and I'm in the middle of a diamond chest plate stuff crisis. So I came to spawn because I saw a thing and it was oh, I, I forgot you could find spawn as well. I see. Um, I started recording on Tuesday because I forgot to vote yesterday. I'm sorry, but you do have day minus one. Please, please don't like string me up from the wall. Please, please don't like publicly shame me in spawn saying he missed a day of opening crates. Okay, it, it doesn't matter as long as we get some good stuff now, right? Uh, okay, <laughs> enough with that. Um, yeah, why? Let me chest saying record when open and I have no idea what's in there. All I know is that um, my um, boots and everything are very much damaged, so objective numero uno. We just need to go check in with the tinker because there's probably something in there, but we might as well start off with our opening crates because we that's how we normally start off a day. So I think I'm in some financial aid. I'm not sure whether editing the ramic will put this in before I can. Okay, every single time I open one here, so it's a robot outfit, right? So we used to have this previous prophecy of opening things in front of the crates, giving those crates? Come on. Like everything's just not existing, so it's not. Okay, well, that, that's some backup armor for now. Right, fine. Right, we'll do, we'll do that one spin to the right. I might as well stop here. Okay, right, well, what have you held for me? You had some like um, tropical skittles tacticals there. And you only check that see, see everything's worked out perfectly in the end, doesn't it? And I guess we might as well spin to the left now, stop around here. It's always this side, it's, I have no idea why. I I'm not opening my books at a bus in face cam, but um it's not really the same old bench, enchanted diamond pickaxe, oh yeah, it's so Right, E for enchanter despite the fact it's Tinkerer, you have no skin on, what's new? Right, view pending actions. I knew I had something on here to put on. So this is my current sword, slaughter 5, poison 3, sharpness 2 and breaking 1, yeah, that's a lot of stuff. Bulk of the episode here, Wyatt also apparently added in another laser sort of thing, so yeah that makes 11 I think, and my computer is just going even faster than usual, I don't know how. I'm gonna get maximum calls and I'm gonna reconsider everything else about my life. Okay right, what have you got? Okay, I did not see that, but there was a... Thank, okay, gift to the remake from my open before when you open it. What is going to be in this exactly? It scares me. It really does, because I'm recording all by myself. I'm not sure, is he, he's definitely like not in the Discord call, because I have that open on another page. So, who, who knows? There's creeps one there as well, my precious child. For those of you who are screaming at me, you're letting light in, it's not letting the creep spawn. I, I figured that out like 20 minutes later, so I didn't lose that much gunpowder. But right, so what's in here? There is a bunch of meat. And okay, why well, I'm gonna look at the skull last, but what have we got up here? Okay, ample five. I have a feeling that's just an enchantment you don't want. Extra shot five. I need to go to the tinker and find out what's the next one. Infinity War. <laughs> um, I could do with that and cannon five again. My old why and there's bloody bigger. There's a tech, no, there is no texture, it's, it's all just a prank. It's, it's just a prank. Okay, well, I know since White probably won't see this until next week, and it's currently Tuesday, we might as well go place this pig above his... There's an Alex head, not Steve. Continuity. In other news, that's a thing that's occurring, like, a lot. So, I know some of these enchantments do, and others I don't need, so... Yeah, tragically, I will have to go ahead and I'm gonna pull away... Cannon 5 and 
extra shot. Actually, no, bring extra shot with us just to learn about it. And ample, I don't. Actually, ample, yeah, that, that can go my helmet. So let's go walk Tinker real quick. I haven't rendered the first episode as well. That's like tonight's major job. I, I am trying to write a Discord bot as well on top of this. It's similar to have the computer plugin on here. Um, I, I don't know. I just sort of like the idea of being active in a server and giving you things. I'm terrible at Python though, so I mean, you probably are expecting far too much of me. So I think we might as well go for the bow and instantly get that tinkering. Um, we have extra shot in infinity. I'm going to do infinity just because, yep, it takes 20 minutes. You can easily get that done. Right, in quickie time. Right, so we just saw that, that goes on bow. So what's extra shot do? Okay, yeah, extra shot. Shoot extra arrows. And it's maxed out as well. And we have ample five. No idea what this does. Okay, are you anywhere here or not? It's probably hit, right? Oh, we're going to be lost as fast. Okay. I can see that happening. You know, we'll we even go ahead and hold the... Where's my... Okay. Crisis averted for a second there. Um, yeah, I need to get this out of public reach so I can't break it. So it has, like, I don't know what... What do you have on it, actually? You know, it's, it's a mystery for another day, but... So, yeah, I'm just going to... We're going to come back in a bit, get ample on it, but... In the meantime, I have no idea how we're going to match up to the last two episodes, because... I mean, look at the progress we've done. I covered this all in white glass, if you probably saw the last clip. I, I could extend this, so it just wouldn't take us long. See, I'm not sure what the undertaking to this episode exactly is going to be. Like, the huge beginning thing is the creeper spawner, and I could have made it over and around. That probably needs to dismantle that sooner. Make it effective. <laughs> probably the latter, so... I mean, I know I literally just disassembled this, and I know it does work, but... Yeah, it's all sort of just falling there. There's no, no real reason for this. I, I could actually make this into my house if I wanted to. See, why has got his house and he has creepers spawn on top? So if I have my house, maybe I won't spawn on top. I should have So hey. Oh yeah, throw your ideas my way in the comments of this one. What I should actually do with that, because I'm not gonna do it this time and I obviously the whole the sugar cane yesterday. Jeez! I, I sometimes I've surprised myself. Right, I'm gonna um, throw away this so I can do more things and you can um, go in there and stop cooking. I'd like to state the following. I did get all of that sugar cane. This is not like it's a profit box. It's just worth a comment for us in his own words. So I have few, not many regrets. So, and as you can see, my financial situation isn't the best. But I mean, hey, I've, I've been AFK a little bit. Maybe I really did treat myself. I'll even go sell gunpowder because white salt will last. Like, he got a good couple thousand out of that. And that's like a good mob of money. I'm not sure why. He, Make it sound a whole better than that when it's like a mob of money. And I know it's AFK, so it's obviously going to have a reduced price, but still, it, it just has a sort of feeling where you're like, oh yeah, that's me. I did that. And I guess we'll sell the rest of the stuff in the profit box. And I have a lot of cacti to sell. How, how much cacti do we have? I surprise myself more and more every single trick to this damn box, I tell you. Uh, you're wondering why there's a boat in my inventory? Funny question about that. There's, there's this person who keeps coming to the island and I give him like a few stacks of cactus in case he wants to sell things. And, oh, okay. And like, I just sell him things and he came and he, he, wanted, he was holding a boat so I placed on the boat and he couldn't get in because I don't know how to like keep doing things. I didn't want to call up in case it was like some form of Russian spy, so... I mean, yeah, I, I, I just, it, it's a long story, short explanation type of thing. I can't condense it all down. But yeah, sugarcane chest just has some random person's tools in. Don't even know who it is, who, like that owns, that, who belo that belongs to anyway. But I think now this should be our last trip if I can place down the boat and like grab another stack. How much have we got here? That's a, come on please. Uh, okay. Of all the times I need to have water bucket on me, now is exactly the time. So let's see how much money. So we're starting at 6,000. I'm gonna look down at the bottom of the screen so I don't see my things. I would do F1 because I wouldn't be able to like navigate my cursor at all. Like, so you have to trust me on that I'm not looking at all. So we started at like 6 summit K, so I'm gonna go off that. And now we can do that. And what have we got? 19K. That's 13K. That's not bad. All things considered, that the gunpowder just made a huge contribution as well. And on top of that, we'll make money. Um, 
again, some of you might be screaming at me for some of the stupid things I did, I mean. <laughs> I mean, Creeper might not be the best option, it's definitely the most satisfying option, because Blaze, you have to do that dodgy thing with the water, and you have to make a grinder and be involved, like, ooh. Um, Enderman, it's more difficult to drop. That's why I think Creeper was a nice little choice, because it, while it might make less money, it's really easy to set up, and this is still a daunting task every time I look at it. <laughs> Okay, blueprint time, efficiency and all that. I have been storing my cryptos in a place worth them keeping them as well. Um, reason this first book's actually so long, it'll probably take about a bunch of the episode, is that I actually have no idea why these first clips take forever. When I just walked at one of my clips, like the original first clip from um, the last episode, which you should be seeing today, that's not recording, like, there was so much I went on about, like, I was like, can you not ramble for like two seconds there in there, mate? Nope, I kept at it for so long. Okay, but I'm just gonna do some stuff, and I believe it is somewhere in the vicinity of 17 cryptos to get my stuff repaired. Now, again, big questions are arising here of whether I should make my own separate cryptos chest and pay for it myself. I have no idea, I'll ask Ryan about it later. But we've done a little um, routine thing, so I was just casually talking about Discord bots and whatnot. So, right now, from now, what, from this point onwards, it, this is its own episode, okay? We're not doing things from past episodes, there's like, no, no random chests out of nowhere. I don't even know what I'm doing over there. But, yeah. <laughs> I also have no idea how efficient this thing is. Like, look, if we were to come here now, just wait for you to vanish. I'm really getting a lot of cactus. Yeah, again, one of the major issues with AFKing right now is that I either have to choose Cactus, which will do more, or Gunpowder, which will sell for more. So, I have no idea on how I'm going to balance AFKing. Maybe there's like a perfect sweet spot. I mean, I would definitely have to be up there. I think I also randomly died up there as well before. But yeah, so, I'm not sure. What I'll do is I will ask um, White about this and ask some of my friends as well. So, sort of what their opinion on this is and whether we'll keep it, whether we won't keep it. And yeah, I want to make this week's episode shorter, and that's not why I missed out, like, the, wait, Monday, okay? Like, I didn't miss Monday out on purpose, I swear. I completely forget about, this, like, this farm as well, so might as well do this. This opening has just been me chatting while I farm, and it's been much more fun than most of the other clips I've done. For example, I believe time-lapse in the last one was so damn long. <laughs> like put it into perspective, I think I might say it in the episode, but if we skip that episode and came straight to this one, that's like roughly about 50 minutes total to do. And that's with a, a little trick to like speed up over four times in Sony Vegas as well. This one I'm gonna exploit to full potential. It's condensed down in like a really small amount of time as well, because I have to cut off the bits where it's dark. So there's a huge sort of issue here. Especially constructing that um the new ways of the um sugar cane farm. That was that was one of the worst things to record because in the, I couldn't waste any dirt. I bought the exact amount of dirt, which was a terrible idea. Never follow in my like space ever again. Terrible idea. It's not, like, it sounded good on paper, but the execution was worse than ever. It had ever been. So right now, the only thing that I can imagine of doing is extending up the glass to, to cover his new layer because he's got it slightly buff. I don't think I'd matter too much though, like, because uh, it sort of ends to drift out a certain angle and all that. I will go ahead and harvest this off camera as well. Um, but I think right now, um, you probably won't see much of me for today, hence why I'm trying to record this and stretch it out for as long as possible. Um, the reason you're not going to see much of me is because I'm rendering and it makes it impossible to render, meaning I'm also putting up Phoenix right for another week. Actually, no, I already have Phoenix right rendered, the hell am I on that? Now, you know what? Two episodes of Phoenix right tonight. Two, two full episodes. You, you better be grateful. <laughs> so I have a lot on my slate to do right now, so I think I'm gonna get back to way of paying and back to making money. And just, just back doing getting back to what I'm good at. And 20k already is just a huge step in the right direction. So here's hoping I remember to vote tomorrow and actually record, and I will see you wonderful people. Probably either tomorrow or probably either later tonight on why it's something once for the second with me. I'll catch so, I just took a look at how long it would take to render the last one, and that video came out, at least the wolf witch came out, 4 hours and 20 minutes. That just shows how much like, watching and skimming and all that stuff I have to do with these videos, so the effort level's definitely there in terms of editing, and I'm sorry if it's going to be daylight on Tuesday, I'm sorry, okay, don't, don't like string me up. 
String me up from the wall is my new favourite phrase, apparently. Like, it's my go-to phrase for whenever I think someone's gonna punish me. Okay, I'll, I'll try and switch it to not whip me for this episode, but we'll try and have each episode, you know, we'll make each episode have that unique punishment that I'm expecting the people of Sky Metro in general just to sort of come and do. So, anyway, AFK has gained me a, a lot of nice sort of things. Um, th there's that. You know, we got, we got some characters, the usual. Um, we got 10 of these things, and I think you know what we're going to be paying a visit to. And I got auto pick up one. And I mean, if I if I know how the AFK mine, I could I definitely do, use that. Like, it's nice to a server, I love this as well. It's nice to a server sort of went in them, out of their way to go ahead and make that. Again, not in the loss. They don't pay me. Yet. <gasps> <laughs> yeah, like also, what's a weird thing is that like the big YouTuber used to not quite like, used to um, do his videos on here. He used to like target 3D gaming. You should check out his videos as well. He has them both in chat. <laughs> so it, I, I, this is probably one of those irrational fears which I'll probably leave in the video as well. But I have this sort of fear that people that want Crimson City. Sky Metro is also going to come onto my videos and they'll see that lack in quality. Like, I don't have that amazing 2D intro. I have the bloody intro from Grass FX. I'm not sure what type of grass he was smoking when he thought it would be a good idea to blast Tobu because that thing's at like 2000 decibels whenever I loaded it. <laughs> but yeah. Eventually, I did manage to render that video down to just under, maybe just over 90 minutes. And oh my god, the time lapse for me destroying the stuff. Why? Why would I think that um, the time lapse of me destroying cobblestone was a good idea? And there's no way for me to even do like do that effectively. It's all weird. It's all really weird. It's all really working out in my favour as well, because now I have that final four. Well, I've been waiting for this for maybe two minutes at most. Here we are. Seven cores. Match that white. Match that. Step to me, I dare you. <laughs> It's been like numerous days since the last update, and in all honesty, you really that surprised, but house has finished, if I can get the beginning of the last clip, because my computer turned off while recording, and in all honesty, I was rambling on that story that I had no idea what I was going to tell about for like so long, so this is the house, um, see, um, I built this, but I thought why it was my friend, and um, he basically flooded it. Now this is actually my house, um, I don't think Wyatt came up into the attic, like, he, he definitely flooded the attic, but afterwards I, um, I put my obvious, um, not that god god set in here. Talking about things, I've managed to match that pretty much up to the top as well. And talking about things, I need to swap out, I need to swap out this. Now, this house, um, so, and basically Wyatt's been in exploring, and what he thinks is that this is a trap, so basically, it's really obvious, you press the button, and initially, it just said trap house, and you'd fall in there and be stuck. But now, there's actually a hole down, so hopefully, he doesn't realise what I'm doing down here, so we might as well go fall down here. I spent numerous hours on that, and I will cover it up, but welcome to the underground area thing. Um, for those of you wondering why I did this, I did this on an old skyblock thing, and oh my god, that is amazing. Like. It's, I think it's just a nice little callback to and building underneath the island as well. It gives us so much more space. And um, remember, if those of you don't know why it's videos, you should go watch them. Because in his video, he was saying he was getting bored and that there was less stuff to do and that we were running out of space on the island for new farms. Like, hashtag personal problems, am I right? So, that, um, I have plans for this. And the reason I'm recording this on Friday is so that when, you know, the actual episode comes around, final clip, rather than being a creeper spawner this time, We'll actually go ahead and be him seeing what um this huge area that I've been working on. But we have two days of voting crates minus today because 24 hours dodgy 11 p.m. votes need to get them down. So um, don't blame me for being inconsistent. Even though it's completely my fault as well. So might as well go straight back to the original tradition and open up the one in front of the crates first, just to get the feel thick. Like, can you not? Okay, in charge of diamond boots, again, I can go on my temporary set while I say open up cryptos to things to do. Might as well open this one in front of the bank, if that's like that direction. I, th I think it is. It's, it's, um, I rendered this into a relatively old pig spawner. Um, you can stack those now, I'll need to show that off. And I suppose for today's, we're going to spin to the left like once and end up here. Yeah, I think I'm going to do like one spin. Rather than doing three and smashing my mouse down for ages, okay, okay. 
It's like in my tool's chest, we might as well go to the left this time. We literally did a 180. Okay, you know what, I'm, I'm gonna redo it, because apparently it doesn't want me to pick that one, and... Okay, we're, we're hit. I need, to, I need to change the length of these things, I swear. I also need to mention how, whenever I'm recording, it always seems to freeze at this one moment. Like, as you can see, it's obviously not, like, kicked me off the server. In fact, they are relatively okay. Oh, whoa! Trippy. And I accidentally punched that one. But yeah, for some reason, the server always lives out when I open these things. Um, I got $5,000. I don't have four bars, so... That's that day's done. No, $5,000 is a whole lot of money. Now... I heard someone, like, in chat a few days ago, actually, like, they were probably joking around, but apparently they reduced the price of buying golem spawners. Probably not. In fact, I doubt it severely. But yeah, what, still 1.5 million. Um, that's a lot of money. If you saw Wyatt, he actually makes 12,000 in one sitting, and he is planning on quitting because there's a lot of stuff for him to do. Don't worry, I have plans to try and engage him more, whereas I'm... Mm. <laughs> Why? <laughs> yeah, I, I, have a, I have a way I think I might be able to engage him with Yan a bit more. I don't know right now though, okay. You were originally in front of the store, so this one counts as that, and then we might as go through the same thing that we do normally. Okay, yep, I will definitely not open anything in between anymore. I should have opened the one with the green particles, how am I in that? I, I'm like, I'm getting armor, but I'm not getting money, so we'll open one in front of the bank for our last one. So might as well open it. Got a few grey particles in there, you know, grey resembles metal and that'll sell some money. See, I seem very accurate in my ways, so I'm gonna spill my eyes closed. Might as well go for two this time and hello there. Alright, what are you gonna give me? Give me like a little more experience boost, please, I already have one. And with the five thousand dollars, apparently fast can nicely you get things. And this time let's go to the left twice. We're right back up where we started. I need to severely think about how I'm doing this spin. <laughs> so, I got the chicken spawn up right. Okay, so, click time. You, we did like a whole lot of opening stuff, but right now, right now, major thing, major thing we get to do. We get to stack up chicken spawns like this. Chicken spawn stack. I think, I think most of you understand what I'm doing here. Yeah, I found a place here. Place here though, and big stack of seven. Like, if I'm to stand here, 11 times count. That, that's how insane this is. Um, why well, also had another way to the character's farm? I don't think I mentioned in the last few clips. And, but we're making all of the money. White's making 12,000 in one trip, and I want to make his rewards a little sweeter, hence we're doing things so wide after he flooded my house, I know. But before we do any of that, I think, I think it's always important to check yourself before you blow up your house and everything with it, because... Yep, stuff began to spawn in my house before I had to park it down, and it's ex still extremely dark, either way. So, if I could like, yeah, okay, there we are, so let's grab some sticks, and, I mean, might as well go ahead and make just, um, 40 torches, what? I mean, the server lags, but it's still fun to play on. <laughs> okay, so, um, my objective here is to go and light up around the island a bunch, because, holy moly, it's almost as if... It's really dark. Chickens begin to spawn the moment I light up the area. See, every little helps. Every little helps. <laughs> and and my, like it gets the worst right around my house because I got rid of all the torches around here to construct it with. As well, like I'm not sure if I'll really be able to recover the, that initial thing because of my reaction to the flooding. Not yet. So we have. Just, we've just wasted like 19 torches on like the rest of the island. Make that 20, 21, 20. I'm very obsessive about my torch placement. Like, well, not, not in the way that it, like, personally, it hurts me internally. Just, I'm not sure. Okay. I can have it there. That, that is the most trappy thing I've ever seen. Like, it just screams, it's a trap. Why would you even think of opening this? Fool. That's exactly the thing I want to go for. Uh, yeah, up here is the worst. I need to go get a bed as well. Like, I'll, I'll get on the sheep spawner later. Okay, I need to like, I need to angle these perfectly because again, like, it I, it doesn't bother me like too badly, but it can still bother me. Yeah, I have no idea what should go in this chest as well. But talking about things which do go in chests, I know some stuff I can drop off in my tools and foods and things. Drop that off in there, I might as well leave my torches in here in case I need any more. But 
down there. I got love bugs on too much. I think I've got to show him off in the north. But yeah, he thinks it was my friend that built this. <laughs> oh, if I can get that clip, that would be amazing. Now, I haven't recorded anything for the last day. But you know, I do like to not record money making. I think you were all either screaming internally or saying, yeah, he's actually going to show us how he makes his fortune. You know, it's, it's not like those adverts where it's like, I got rich using this one easy quick set moment. It's not like that. It's not, it's not quick or effective. In fact, in fact, it's very tedious and boring at times. But it doesn't matter. So, I'm going to go pack away everything. So, that. And may I just show off my boat as well? Because I, I think I might have hovered over them previously, but I just wouldn't draw attention to now. My sword's very good, minus sharpness and unbreaking. My bow is just unbreaking and power is lacking a bit. Wow! Wasn't expecting that to happen. Might as well keep this. And I just want to show off how far this goes. Look, look if I want to light up some areas that up there, it, it was a little temporarily, and that's all that matters. A for effort. So, I suppose what I'm going to do now is I'm going to start a new clip, and I'm going to time lapse chat with you all because um, harvesting, gotta harvest this, gotta harvest that, replant that, and grab a bunch of cactus, put it on the cross the chest, and I have to go sell things, and then I'll be back once I'm finishing. But I'm going to go have a little time lapse chat with some of you guys because. I haven't really talked, I've just sped up the music and well yes there will be louder music than normal in some parts of it after I finish talking. I don't think I've been a nice little thing considering that I like can barely talk to you people when you know when I'm actually like trying to do something that, that that's the elusive chess plate which I've been missing for the entire episode. Anyway, yeah, but let's try and get on with the time up. I have no idea how long this is gonna take, I swear. Once again, the fact that I said I do one of these caught me by complete surprise. Now, first of all, um, later in the episode, um, you're only 35 whole minutes in roughly at this point, and I have to say thank you for watching these episodes, I know they're long, but I want to know your opinion. What format would you like more? Me to record small clips throughout the week, or to do one sort of big clip on one day and focus on one huge project so I don't get worn out as fast? I'd, I'd like to know things, so would you like more content to consume which is less edited, or, you know, more content no, less content which is more edited or more content which is less edited. <laughs> like, um, I'm not sure, I could focus on one big thing, like I could have made the house the focus of a little episode, then the platform, mother and all that, but I'm not sure, I like the little progress that they feel and the progression of every single day, leading to sort of new sort of feel of the island, but I'm not sure. Now this time lapse is a long one, so <laughs> get in store wrongly, feel the way in. Um, so in these following clips, I was still really sort of enthusiastic, like hell yeah, Skywalk all day every day. Um, right now, it became a lot more focused, at least as of soon, it became a lot more focused on AFKing and the results of what we get from that AFKing. So, Sugar Cane became less of a focus, meaning making less money, but we were also making more money because we AFK AFKing for longer, which is one of the weirdest concepts I've ever introduced in my head, but it's basically what's happening. So, we're making less money on the server, but the more money we make from AFKing, eventually that will topple Sugar Cane, which in the long run works because it means. We don't have to do import, like, um, <laughs> as you can see right there, I actually um, saw some signs basically directing left stand direct on top of the creep spawner for maximum efficiency. And yeah, it's that. And there's also a little exploit which I might bring in brief detail where, um, so for those of you who, um, don't watch me in my spare time when I'm not recording, me and might have little bow battles, and since he can't do PvP, the only thing he can hurt me with is the bows and fishing rods and eggs and all that, but, um, yeah, so people can actually come onto your and bypass that with bows as well and kill you while you're AFK and you can also knock off items make sure that your manual settings are set. I do this later down the episode but I thought I might as well warn you now, 35 minutes into the episode rather than a whole hour and a bit, um, that you know this is an actual issue. Um, if any admins could sort of get on that that'd be great, like I did try to disable my own PvP for ages now. I'm not sure what happens in the upcoming part of the time lapse, I think, yeah I'm so full punch on Kane. Um, yeah, so I go put all of that in the profit box, and now I have to begin the very tediously long walk, walk, swim all the way up to the top again. Another issue, got to fix. Now, I think next episode, I'm going to be at max 20 minutes, and it'll be shot in one day with all the different sort of things done. Because um, Christmas is coming up, I need to focus more time on 12 days dynamic, and this is basically the equivalent to that. It's always there in the background, chipping away. Um, you know, just one thing is leading to another. Um, finally finished the sugar cane this time lapse anyway. Sorry if it all looks very dodgy, but that's what my computer is. Um, I should also mention that um, I've begun to lose footage again because my um, reset button and all that, the front of my PC came off, that feels like I've been pressed now. Anyway, end of time, it's okay, bye! 
And so, the harvest came to an end at roughly 10 minutes or something like that. Very, very long time, but uh, I AFK the character, so, so we made like 4,400 from this. I am taking far too long to so 4,400, or oh, if the maths gets like, just a oh, whole worse out with this, I swear. So, so 4,400 is what I'm gonna go with. I'll just round it up to the nearest hundred. So I want to see if I can beat Wang in his record sales. So 4,400, so already a third of the way there, roughly. So I basically need to hit 13,000, 14,000, whatever, and I beat his sale, which is... I'm not sure why I want to beat it, I just want to know. I, I know that I want to beat it. So, 4,400 then. Yeah, we might as well sell a bit of this. So, 4,400, let's try and put this on top. It, 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 just, it just has to be... Rough. It doesn't have to be like below, you know, or anything. As long as it's like a decent way over 13,000, I'd call this good. So, 4,400, adding on a bunch of random stuff. So, I don't have a calculator with me on like why it did. So, 4,400, add another 4,400. So, that's 8,800. Golly gee. Oh, this is gonna hurt my head by the end of it, isn't it? Okay. 4,400, no, 8,800 in fact, see, I get literally cannot remember anything, 8,800, we need the sale to be just good in general, 8,800 adding this means we get, like, let me think, right, okay, 8,000 plus 5,000 is 13,000, yeah, basically we just hit 15k in one sale, take that wire, take that, that's what you get for AFKing. Yeah, for those of you who don't know what the profit box is, if, um, basically if we're not in the mood to do a bunch of selling things, we can let the other person sell, because basically all the money goes towards the same thing. I might as well put the cryptos on top, and me and three, I don't keep that in my trash blueprints chest, but talk, talking about things that we need to trade, and I have not dealt with those for ages, crypto time. Um, and what we've came to an agreement on now is we're not going to buy anything with cryptos until I repair my dog kit, because why it completely demolished me when it was like it had no good or sort of protection on anything. So yeah, we've came to an agreement on that. The 17 crypto will be used to repair my stuff and then we'll go back and forth on the stuff really. The, the main aim is to get one of our cores to like, you know, we need to save up like a hundred cryptos or something weird like that. And only then can you get like properly good functioning things but we've got nine out of the 17 cryptos we've only got eight more to go and since i have all seven cores now um i know why i added so significantly less time but you know we've got both of our cores working out seven of mine no six of mine generating cryptos i believe yep only one generating blueprints but 15k in one sale is not bad now like I said, these episodes are meant to be long again, so might be the content that you're, you know, used to taking in. The content that I've literally always made, it's always been relatively long. So, I mean, th this series has been no exception, going throughout the week and just doing things, because it's literally my game. I have forgotten the torches, and I forgot to, um, repair that hole in the ground, see. Right now, it's just one of I I left my torch somewhere else, didn't I? Um, yeah, I, I don't know. Just this house is one of those things. It is so calming to have my own house and space. Like, and it's in a thing. It's somewhere which you know. It's we've taken the old land and we've made it completely new and amazing. And just it, it, it's been completely revitalized. So there is no way in hell that anyone would want to do that. Luckily, me being the idiot I was, I tried to build like double piston extenders do the do mission it's in like impossible um now first of all the, the entire concept of that is really dumb second of all how have i not seen this huge bulky thing and thought hey this is suspicious and third of all she gets covering up the thing from the, the bottom so might as well most of you are probably wondering why i got off mid sentence there and there's good reason for that um this clip has successfully been visited by the time lapse police. This is a private force I've set up, which involves myself and Sony Vegas 14 mode, and I'm watching over the footage for this series, if it's a long episode, and I ramble on doing stupid little tasks and nothing really interesting pops up in the conversation. 
I'm just gonna speed it up and I'm gonna talk over it. And yeah, so, um, first time lapse ended very impromptu, like I didn't even see the time. It, it was so slow for the first bit, and then at the end it was just like, neon, was it taking up speed. So yeah, um, I'm gonna try this with other ones as well, where I have a nice little chat with you all as well, just over some of the footage, because the footage is productive, it's just sort of boring to watch. If it, at normal speed, but watching it more condensed down and seeing the progress is actually great. So, um, what is down here is a little platform, um, it'll come up later, but basically, this is to try and engage White back into the server because he said he was becoming disengaged and all that stuff. So, um, yeah, we are. I'm falling to my death after I'm spawning on the island. I need to change the island spawn into a huge puddle of water, it would fix so many issues. Um, I should mention this now that um, me and White actually plan to expand the creeper spawners because they'll begin to pay themselves off a whole more effectively. Like, um, I'm not sure if this makes sense, but um, with each one, I, you'd get more money faster, which means you could buy and pay them off faster. I'm not sure how it works exactly. Like, I would try and make a, like a graph. So, um, average spawn rates for creepers, average stack rates for creepers, most common, how much gunpowder they drop, what gunpowder sells, so put that all into an equation, figure out how much time it sells for one, then for two, then for three, then for four, then you get the gist, and then how, when, it, when it becomes more cost effective for you in the long run, sort of two, three days pay off. So I think I want to do some more advanced maths in the next episode, which I know my maths in the last episode were inaccurate, like I times cactus while you were sleeping, which is bad. But in other news, in the last clip, I said my computer's front panel came off, and that's true. When we took the front off to install the new motherboard, which I got for my birthday, and what happened was is that the front bit just tended to come off, and it's not clipped back on since. Now, there's a bunch of wires leading into the front, and one of them is um, two USBs, headphone, microphone jack, and what you know my power button and reset button now my reset button if held will instantly power off the computer as if it's an emergency shut down and it will then go ahead and reboot the computer now my computer has literally been doing that whenever it's getting either too hot which i can understand because um, i do have a temperature monitor and ram monitor which i need to fix and also just randomly now i think what's the issue is that it's being pressed down otherwise malfunctioning since it's been stretched so far out like it which is the leans forward so that's why I'm getting a new case for Christmas. Um, here I am, in fact. Um, yeah, basically I'm saying how I will make lower levels, but they'll be inaccessible. Like, I'll make sort of walls so you can't land on them and all that, or you die die fall damage. Um, and that hide sort of buttons and shops and all that. I think that area's gonna be sort of underground town. Um, in the end, um, you'll probably see why it does move his tree farm in there, as a matter of fact. So here I am, and I attempt to get this painting perfect. And um, someone else buys gift cards. now. Um, I'm not sure why, but they'll take up the maximum amount of space they're allowed rather than just randomly. So, what I, uh, I realise it's by like, things off centre, like it's an uneven amount of blocks, that one wouldn't work. So, I decided to do this and adapt it, so that's there. And um, White doesn't end up shifting that amount of camera as well. I, try, I think I fix it. And then, um, basically, um, those of you who don't understand, um, in the lost clip, because of my reset button malfunctioning, um, White actually flooded my house. Except I told him it wasn't my friend's house, which is a completely not a place to lie, which is such a good prank in return. Because he literally spent the entire time flooding it. It didn't do much, that could was terrible, as I probably said. But yeah, um, I said it was someone called Wendo? I'm not sure, I, I think it was a nickname for Wendell or something. And I said, and I said just call them you. I have no idea what I was thinking, but here I am enchanting my stuff. And here it is, me beginning to round off the clip. Basically, I just expand that platform. I'm going to expand it to be a whole island level thing off um, camera, maybe in a time lapse, but that's all there is to come. So now I'm going to hand you back over to Naramik in the bank where he's about to repair his stuff. I hope you like seeing me think of some stuff because that's all I do this episode. Why? Guess where we are? We're at the bank. I have 17 crypto shards and I have, surprisingly, 17 crypto shards. Now, me and White, we both don't need these crypto shards. He's got all his cores, I've got all my cores, we don't need these anymore. And I finally saved them off. Now, I have AFK the majority of these. I think one or two of them might be White's. I can give them back to him, but I need to repair this set because I've discovered something about my island, whether it's the fact that I've posted videos or not, that's the case that people are doing this. I'm not sure, but I know it definitely needs to be addressed. So. Either way, I might as well go one, two, three, four, swap these out. We'll start with the boots. Actually, no, we're starting with the helmet. That thing is beaten half to death. So, repair an item, five cryptos, nothing that bad. But basically, um, what happened is on my island, people came in while I was AFKing and they um, proceeded to go ahead and 
basically, the proceeds go ahead and, um, you might assume me and White, I, I said that White went through my armor with a bolt, right, right, if I was going to IS right now, I have to save PvP between us, because we have a little, um, fight, you know, not like big falling out one, no, but you see, he's, he's disloyal, but he's still able to shoot me with his bolt, so, um, that's also the case with visitors, so while I was there playing, I saw someone come in, they removed item frames, and there's actually no way, like, I'll even go on here right now, it's either I'm blind as a bat, which I know other people think I am, and see, you, you can see here there's not really, I mean, there is island flags here, but like I said, if I were to come on, go ahead here, global flag, it, everything's pretty much the same, it's just those, like, um, even if I come here right now, um, <laughs> that's undefined, I am switching that to disabled, but there is still no bow setting as well, as you can see, um, like, item pickup, that's, I'm going to set that to disallow as well. It's just this type of stuff which I'm not sure why it wasn't set to disallow, but it wasn't. So I wanted to bring that to attention as well. Um, yeah, there's no bow setting, so basically they can fire willy nilly with a bow and get away with it, which is very annoying for any of you who know that. See, crop trampling, for example, another big one. But, now I've said that, can I get to repairing my boots? I'd love to have that happen. <laughs> So, I've got 17 cryptos, and this is going to take a while to do, like I said right now, we only have 8 cryptos left. <laughs> so, I mean, it, yeah, these don't take too long, but I want to show you people that my little bit of progress that I've made. So, um, um Master Scare came online yesterday, at least he was supposed to, and I gave him a few signs, which says this way, you keep going. Um, and come through here to when those creepy little conversation where I completely demolished the light. He thought that it was me. <laughs> he thinks it's something called a window. <laughs> yep, successful direction fall with 10 out of 10. Now press. Now fall. Please remove all sides for this. It's up to him white by now. So go press this. This opens up. I fall down here. Woo! I told him to pull the house. Yes. Underground area is coming to life. I did extend it tiny, but the reason why I actually wanted to show this off. It's because I've, I've tried to extend this out a slight amount because I want to get some mobs to spawn on here just to show how overpowered my gear is. Like, I, I know, showing off, it's probably like a YouTuber's worst habit. <laughs> like, I've got the name Jake Paul and Rice for one. But I, I just wanted to go and show how this stuff is. Like, if I went into Warzone right now, I'd probably get ruined to my armor again. I want to repair it and I just want to put more stuff on it. I want to make it completely sort of pristine armor. But yeah, in, at the moment, that's not the case. So, I mean, I would go into PvP. Heck, hey, I keep saying I would go into PvP. I need to have faith in my weapons, okay? I think I have a good amount of chance here. I know I need to level it up with Unbreaking. Yes, I have worked on a few enchantments to get level up from Unbreaking 1. I've tried to get, like, Unbreaking 3 and all that. And blueprints. It's very difficult to get Unbreaking because everyone just, like, repairs it at Tinkerer. So, I mean, is there anybody here at Warp PvP? Probably not. Like, I would go to some random person's island who's AFKing and shoot them with my bow and kill them so they don't, you know, spawn in creepers because they forgot to close the door. But, see, I'm not, I'm not that scummy. <laughs> so, there you are. If you want your attention in the video, there you are. It's always the same guy as well. And, like, people were just killing him on site when they spawned in at the round. So, <laughs> I'll let you figure that out as you will. But I suppose, yeah, there's no crates. I, I would, yes, I, I do have an actual nice set of armor here, but one thing that I haven't done soon, we're gonna go warp spawn, if I could spell correctly, and we have vote shop to do, I have no, ha, no idea how many of these I have left over, I just know that I didn't vote, yes! It's like, just as I teleport away as well, no, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna kill you in a minute, it was this man. Okay, I'm, go I'm gonna get this, and then I'm gonna go to spawn. Just, it's my luck, isn't it, that that would happen? That it would, like, it would do it right as I'm about to leave. Now, if I have pogo boots, it'd be a lot more easy, but, like, I I'm, I'm not seeing indicating, like, my character's not in shape, but, I mean, it's, it's difficult. I, I, I might as well use my exploit, because there's no way to get around this. I, I can't, I don't want to go climbing. See, people make all these Sonic Forces memes, and, like, Sonic forces you to hold his hand, or Sonic forces you to have fun, oh wait, it's all over. No, um, how about we make an, a new meme, Sky Metro forces you to put effort into getting crates. Yeah, th these crates are either extremely easy to get or extremely difficult, and I was doing them before Wyatt, so if he says in his videos, which I know he said, it was my idea to get crates, I've been completely spamming them, he's wrong. I was getting the crates OG, I'm the, I'm the OG, okay, can we, can, can we bring back the OGs on Sky Metro? Like, like, not ironically. 
please. I, I want I want the OGs back. The Pablo OG stealing the show. It's just it, it's meant to be okay. Like I, I would be an OG, but I I don't think my legs want to coordinate with me here. And I I want to go see if that guy has anything to give me. Possibly, you know. I always accept a gift or two, especially with the um, you know, few million spawners. Like, imagine if that wasn't like a pig spawner or anything, but that was like an iron golem spawner. That would be very um, very bad. And I see Challenger. You know that Pokemon Go song, Pokemon Go to the polls, etc. Can I not actually make it up here? I I want to go up here. Please, don't do this to me now. Oh wait, nope, there's still no chance of me getting up there. Come on, please, fly exploit, I beg you. Please. Please, Sky Metro Gods. Do me like this ten solid or something. Oh! I, oh. <laughs> oh I got it! Ha! 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 Oh! He, he runs away, but he it's too late! <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> I got the member kit after all of that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I feel nice to be in Warzone. <laughs> so, and what's. I know, not Warp Spawn, I've got far too used to saying that. Spawn, just normal spawn before he comes and tries to kill me. <laughs> that went off without a hitch, I swear. See, I'm trying to add that little bit of variation into my videos. Come on, can I see that guy who wanted to give me something? Like, I don't mean to greedy, but I just don't want to loop out the Zartan again. See, he's pointing at me. Yeah, yeah. Voting crate time. I mean. Oh, hi. People are bowing at me. Cool. Unless this... The elusive server has frozen again when I try to open a crate. <sighs> this doesn't happen when I'm not recording, okay? Like, when I'm not recording, I open crates. I'm like, God damn it, I did not open this crate. I go to open OBS and boom, the server crashes. It's definitely not the server's fault. It's definitely OBS's fault for eating through 20% um, of my CPU's power. <laughs> you know, who knows? Okay, I, I, you know, for a second there I thought someone was actually bowing at me, but no. But that was not the case. Um, now all of you get to see my server list, or not. Um, this is the one issue I have with Sky Metro. I have, like, such a bad connection. I have three star, like, three in bars. Everyone else has five, because they were in the US. I have no idea why that bothers me so much. It shouldn't, but it does. So, let's, um, open these up now. We will open, well, traditionally, open up the one in front of a crate seven times. I think that's the last, but what we got? 15,000, yeah, that, that, that's definitely unlucky. Woo. Okay, he, he wants me to open one here again. I mean, I, I ain't one to disobey fans. Oh, oh, I know you, I know you, hi. Oh, okay. Yeah, like I said, I'm not opening one like again, right? Okay, can we continue the bank conspiracy, though? The bank conspiracy. So there's opening stuff in front of the bank. Okay, that's, that's not in front of the bank, but it's also not that far out. Okay, yeah. Lesson learned, never do that. Gonna spin one, two, and three times today. Ending up around here. And we'll see what we're gonna get. Can we, can we give me some more money? I want an enchanted bell, hey. You, you can have that. Who says I'm not generous? Might as well spin around that. Oh, what are we gonna stop on? Um, this one. Okay. Yeah, I did like try to go a little further to the left because I don't. I tend to like rotate around in full circle. Enchanted diamond helmet, I mean. I guess I'll keep that in case like my PvP set just like decides to no got AVI out on me, so. Overall, not bad crates. I'm at 70k. I have no idea how much money Wyatt has, but. I'm pretty sure most of you this episode you're like, but the rest of them focused on creep spawner. I know, exactly. I'm so sorry if it's something to focus on the creep spawner. It should be. Like, it honestly. I, I just realised how messy this area. I could have put that in there as well. I could put my door in there. I didn't. I, I, I love these intros. I just go into Wendell's house. <laughs> yeah, so, um, like I said, pixel art huge thing. And I have, like, no idea how I'm going to make it work. But, warp shop. So, any of you know me, I'm not that much of an artistic person, I'm more like autistic, so we're going to try and do this without looking severely impaired, which for me is, you know, very difficult, it's, it's not, it doesn't come naturally, so we need like two colors, we need like putridly lime green, and like that, we'll, we'll just get four more of that to have it all even out, so, oh, uh, this green face isn't going to look good at all, is it? <laughs> right. <laughs> 
I, I have my I have my confidence that this might look good and it probably will, but I have my doubts that it won't. The synapse, the time lapse, Rolly. <laughs> no, the time lapse police have returned again. This time I'm building a really ugly creeper, and it's not that good with commentary. Why? I just subjected myself to the whole clip, like the things I do for you now. This is all part of the name to try and make the video under one hour. And if these next few clips don't need stretching out and there's nothing to add on the end, the video will be under one hour. Meaning people might watch it, I still got some good watch time, and it still gets promoted by YouTube for the sweet ad rev. So, um, for those of you who don't know, I'm making a creeper face to go on the creeper spawner, which um, should be part zero of this. And it will be. I just need to bump everything up a little bit. And I'll, even this is my old intro, I haven't even thought about putting that in. <laughs> but yeah, so creeper bit, I still need to pull in. I don't think anyone understands how I got the creeper bit, so, <laughs> yeah. Time-lapse please can be his own little joke, right? <laughs> like, in the comments of this video, or just any other video where I have unnecessary stuff, time tag it from where it begins and when it ends, and just t comment time-lapse really, please, like, sign -ups. I can't speak, I'm so sorry, but I'm gonna leave you to the rest of this time-lapse now, because I need to stop sleeping, because people are trying to sleep in my house, and that's pretty much everything, so, oh, thank you. Thank you for putting up the time lapse, police. Um, yeah, the creep looks really sort of sad. I don't think it's supposed to, but it is. Um, it, it looks amazing. I think the final thing I do now in the agonizing quest to go and do things, I try and get myself a diamond pickaxe or a bunch of cobblestone. I'm not sure what I'm trying to, you know. Oh, I think I'm trying to actually fix the cobblestone generator with a lapis thing. And I came to like get something else. Oh, no, I, I wanted to get torches to light up the creeper face. How could I forget? Because that was such a quintessential part of the build that I decided to not cut the footage down in there. But this has been the time lapse police. I'm going to leave you with the final like half a minute left of this time lapse. There we are, me taking plenty of screenshots just to make sure that I actually have enough. Oh, I think just to end this off, I finally placed those two blocks back. God damn. And I just go on a harvest rampage as well, why don't I? So yeah, so I'm definitely profitable in selling the FK stuff, but oh my god, when it comes to sugar cane, I'm just like, yeah, be away from myself. So anyway, time lapse police version two. I'm gonna try and keep count of how many times I have to do this. <laughs> it's actually quite funny. So it's like very light right now that I'm finally in my new setup and I'm able to buy one of the new cell ones for 15 cryptos with 200 uses. There we are. Now it's like past midnight, 15 minutes past midnight, I should not be awake, but new set requires me to do this as well, but there's a lot of stuff in here, and I'm planning to hit it once, hit it twice, <laughs> it's so perfect, it's just so innocent in its own right, I'm, I, I want to um, open it up, okay, so 196 uses, so that means 100 double chests of use, um, so that's basically all there is to it, um, now we have one of those, there's literally not much else we can do, I'm sorry if you can hear my keyboard um, hitting the ground a lot as well, and hopefully that doesn't bother you too much, but yeah, so I, w I just wanted to document getting the cell one, because it's just one of those things where now we harvest all the sugar, we harvest all the cactus, we harvest all the gunpowder, we put it in these two chests, use the cell one, and it's just all gone to be sold, and it's just absolutely amazing, like, if I wait for my balance to come out right now, it goes somewhere on 94,000, and 84 and if um why yeah which is watch these episodes they come out a bit more frequently than mine um should go and watch this because we're planning to get another creep spawner make them spawn in even faster than build a whole new one going spawner underneath but it's all i can really do for now because it's really sort of um late at night i shouldn't even be awake i should be asleep so i'm gonna sign a flower and oh, yeah um tomorrow's the final day so, and also I'd like to say, I know um, earlier I didn't do the crates, um, they were set to like 11pm and I would not throw at that time because it messed me up, so yeah, <laughs> I just didn't want to mess up my sleep schedule for some crates and now they're more readily available as well, so yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in the next clip, which is either opening crates, my outro, or the island has been destroyed once again, I have no idea what it will be at this point, I sincerely hope it's not the former though. So... It's Tuesday. This video was supposed to go yesterday and I was supposed to be recording on Sunday but I didn't do an outro so I'm doing one now and yeah and there is a whack of a tree farm. Uh huh what so this is different um 
yeah, for those of you who don't know what this little room is, I don't think I've showed it off in a previous clip. Basically, it's where I was going to hide some redstone, but that was just a nice little back out room. And it was concealed by the tree farm that White seems to have removed, so... Yeah. This week we've not done too much, actually. Like, I have pretty much repaired my stuff. I have yet to check in on um, how White's been doing on the server. I know he's definitely been on the AFK. I know, I know that much, but I haven't been on, so... I feel relatively not. I feel really bad about that. Um, the issue is with this island right now is, like I said, um, the same issue with why it's happening with me with a whole lot slower because I can stretch my out throughout the week. Um, the, I'm running out of things to do. Like, of course, there's plenty of things I could do in future episodes, which I will focus on. Again, I could just make single day episodes. But I don't know, but I think um, for those of you who don't know. Um, yeah, I, I left a few direction signs like, yes, keep going over here and when those crib, which is a little inside joke with myself. And, and why, obviously. <laughs> why, why would you make an inside joke with yourself? Okay, successful direction, follow the time, now press, now full DDF, and absolutely zero surprises. And that is a... Oh, that, that's where I even Well, I definitely know where I'm going to be hiding my next route down, I hope, but... Why it moved things down here? Okay. I think I can dig this. In fact, having it down here it seems just about better if it weren't to cover almost. Just don't destroy this tree, okay? I'm just make a nice little leaf tunnel. So I, I guess this area can be expanded down. Like we might even try and make it similar to um, like how my island was last season. I don't have any screenshots of this staircase. Believe me, I scoured it for ages trying to figure out what the staircase was. Basically. Leaves lined the sides, stairs coming down, the locks and all that. You get the gist, and it was so well lit as well. It still is around the edges here. So, I think, though, we, we've seen enough change on the out warrant an episode. I just wanted to get this outro done. And I'm sorry it took so long to get this video out to you. I know a lot of you like these videos, which is so nice to just go ahead and see that people are enjoying this. Like, it just sort of means the world to me that, in, in a way... I'm still managing to sort of pump out content of this without it getting stale. Like, like I said, I'm running out of things to do, but I think I'm able to not make it stale. That's all. I always try to do that with um, Five Nights at Race 4 with the edits in the last few episodes. <laughs> so I'm going to try and be con more consistent on that one as well. But with that, I think next week I'm going to do more up here. We have a whole new space. I have the feeling I could take inspiration from a different Skywalk server, which I'm sure many of you are familiar with, but none of you were ever in. I don't think any of the people that Skywalk server are still around doing their business, so I think we might be able to make a nice little homage to about about Skycade Keyspree in the regular day on Skycade. I think we might be able to make a nice little homage, I'm not sure. You should go watch those videos, I'll make sure to put in an end screen with them in. Um, in fact, the end screen might as well be appearing now with post, post, post editing and uploading and um, bloody formatting and error makers listening, which you probably are because you check the ends of the videos for fade out transitions, not not graphical errors or anything, you creep. <laughs> I, I think I should have a um, mental test. Actually, I have a whole extra day left in 12 days in error make. Yep. Um, I'll, I'm taking an autism test for 12 days in error make. That's the third time to take them off. <laughs> no, I don't. I have been um, past them. So, yep, top ladies and rabbit, I'm going to take an autism test just, just to prove things, okay? <laughs> but yeah. So, we've all said and all our side, this has been a long ass week. And I'm gonna do a long ass AFK session to make up for me not being here. So, with all said and all our side, thanks for watching, guys. My name's Remick, and peace out.